Cleanup and recovery efforts are underway in New Zealand after Cyclone Gabriel left five dead and more than 9,000 displaced. Prime Minister Chris Hipkins said the damage was extensive as he praised New Zealanders for supporting each other. According to an official, though the weather has improved around the Auckland region, authorities continue to see impacts to unstable land. A sandstorm has hit the desert city of Las Vegas. Whirling clouds of sand made driving conditions on a highway particularly treacherous. Locals complained of poor visibility as they couldn't even see in front of them. Video captured by a resident showed cars appearing to disappear into a tan-colored wall of sand as they progressed down the highway. A rare video from the 1986 dive that was the first to film the sunken ship Titanic has been released. The footage, captured by a team from Woods Hole Oceanographic Institution, showed the Titanic lying on the seabed after the ship sank on its maiden voyage. Efforts to locate the luxury liner began after the ship sank in 1912, but were unsuccessful until advances in deep sea technology led to its discovery in 1985. The ship was sailing from Southampton, England to New York when it hit an iceberg and sank and an estimated 2,000 passengers on board, some 1,500 died. The earliest and most complete Hebrew Bible ever discovered that dates back more than 1,100 years nice. is to be sold at an auction. The estimate value is expected to reach $50 million. According to an expert, if the 1,000-year-old holy book sells for near its estimated value, the Codex Sassoon would become the most valuable printed text or historical document ever sold at an auction. The Codex Sassoon is named after the precious owner David Solomon Sassoon who acquired the Bible in 1929 and assembled one of the most significant private collections of Judaica and Hebraica manuscripts in the 20th century. A team of Peruvian paleontologists has unearthed the well-preserved skull of a prehistoric sperm whale. According to researchers, the skull, complete with teeth and jaws, was preserved in the desert area for 7 million years. The 4.3 feet long skull belonged to an adult whale, estimated to be between 16 and 18 feet long. The skull was, has been put on display in Lima's National History Museum. The 71-year-old musician and former police frontman Sting will be honoured at this year's IWAS. The annual awards honouring songwriters and screen comp composers. He will also be awarded a fellowship by the Ivor's uh, Academy. Sting, who has already won seven Ivor Novello awards, including a Lifetime Achievement Award in 2002, will become the Academy's 23rd fellow.